and we're waiting. waiting yeah and kex is in and that means that we're going to start the game soon finally well monklefu still connecting but then we are should be ready for the we final are. game nick Hype. Uh, Hype. finally finally the chat will be happy because the chat is not happy that we talk this much so uh sorry guys sorry for the delay we will be going in game now we will transition to the in-game chat at this moment uh the in game i will press uh f5 i will press f1 and i will press o to start the game and uh that means that we're ready it's a uh, fun uh, we have fantastic war on the blue side and on the red side we have tactical training team um yeah, you do your team and I do my team because I really want to know if they're going for the launchers instantly. I don't, I don't, uh, I don't like the blue side. I hate the blue side. I like the red side. So red side be us, one hundred percent. And um, okay. it looks like not uh, that uh, much weapon diversity by TTT. Only five, five, six guns. Yeah. Well, these guys are trained by a Carbiner, let me tell you that. And we know that Carbiner hates everybody with a 556 guy gun. So uh, only one guy got a 556 and the rest got a 6.5. And uh, as I guessed, L1 instantly going for the rocket launcher. And call me Dodo was rocket launcher too. That was a Nate. And the first rocket launcher went off. Nobody near it though. Here comes L1's counter. Three, two, one. And he's getting one, Kill. Dylan. Yes, yeah. nice. So really well done by L1, training the rocket launcher and uh, getting the first kill of the match. So uh, here they go, in a line. They start pushing forward. I see a nade being through, throat. And on the right side, in a ray, died by Daniel. TTT is also pushing quite hard. They, Although Fantastic yeah. War is holding now. And uh, we are... Uh, yeah. Nah, we'll... nah, against El Basto and Daniel on the left. Is it? Is, it, is this the, the left side? Uh. No. Yeah. The uh, south side the... is the open side, or the south it's... side is at the building, and the north side is at the construction. So yeah. where, where El Basto and Daniel now? Tane is still there. El one getting some kills. Uh, but call me Dodo is there for the trade. Tane doesn't see it. A little bit nervous. And Tane dies. So at this moment, TTT has the overhand and has two guys at their 80 line and uh, is trying to get closer. In a redo, there to uh, intercept call me Dodo. He knows he's there. He's trying to look. Getting around the corner. And call me Dodo is just waiting for uh, friendlies. Timing. Nice timing. In a re killing the and guy, Gator. On the it's Gator again defending. But in a re yeah. and Iluan and Tane still supporting. Yeah, TRS, by the way, all the way up to the uh, north side uh, or the south side, running all the way up. Call me Dodo didn't got shown yet, but he's trying to go for the touch. But Gator is there. And a re killing uh, El Busto, which opens up the field a little bit more on the north side. Nunrod going yeah. forward. And in the meanwhile, we have uh, Demon uh, sitting around the corner. El Costa heard him. And he died. He threw a nade, though, but it's not looking like it will kill anything. And now maybe it's the time for Fantastic Ball to push out a little bit because three, three people from TTT are respawning. Spawn. Yep. And so now maybe it's, it's time to push. Fantastic War got the overhand now. Are completely there on the right hand side. In a re died though. Nunward still alive. But Fantastic War is holding. Nunward is going for a touch. And he gets it. He, he gets, gets it. <laughs> Jesus reloading. And he's, getting the touch. And he's even getting away with it. And he dies no. at storage. Well, there you go. First touch for Fantastic War. And Fantastic yeah. War is not giving up because Tane is already for the follow up there. And killing, Tane killing too. Tragically, tragically, Jesus did a uh, um, friendly fire kill and needed to reload after that. And that's the exact point in time where Fantastic War pushed the flag and yeah. got in the touch. 
really well played and it was a bold move from Nonward, but he knows that he just needs the flag touch to be on the winning side now so not bringing it home and there were a lot of people around him but he got the flag touch and that brings the flag touches for fantastic war to one what will uh give them the lead at the moment demon That's and right. l1 uh fighting it out at the containers while uh, on the north or on the south end side uh two guys are waiting l1 getting the kill moving forward They, Fantastic War is really playing aggressively, I need to say that. Oh yeah, that's right. Pushing, getting the attackers first on the, uh, on the open up of the, the tactic and open up the pressure against Tactical Training Team 2. And then looking at the kill feed, uh, Fantastic War got three kills and that's the sign for them to push up. And there comes Inari and Nunward all the way up to their 80 line they're now there they're there at the four l1 gets the kill now it's good now it's supporter defender oh no it'll cast with flanking crossfire yeah nice, nice, nice crossfire nice crossfire but still trs but and Tana there and in still i Tana knows where he is so come nice rocket didn't expect it there but they're getting swarmed by fantastic war Fantastic War coming around the corner. The Chisa sees him and killed him, but still one alive. Inuka's not taking attention. Now only Jesus is there. TRS knows she's there. Offensive, and, uh, yeah, really yeah, offensive yeah. defending from Jesus. Yeah. That, that to be honest, the first thing that we 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 saw this in this whole tournament, the defender stepping out of the protection and. Mm -hmm. Engaging the attacking player. That, at, uh, if I recall correctly, this uh, never happened in the so, uh, tournament, right? Um, indeed. Fantastic War had the overhand there, but uh, TTT uh, really well uh, defended that position. A lot of booms going off at the moment in yeah. the middle. Tane and Komi Dodo uh, in a fight. And Tane winning that fight. Demon still alive though. Running past TRS, is he going to spot him? He is. And Demon getting him. Demon running up to the office building. But Gator is still watching that flag. And he didn't move. Do they know? Fantastic War also at the enemy flag again. Daniel taking the opportunity to uh, move forward. None worth uh, killing a uh, guy, but uh, the cheese is still there. Now there were two. Is this a second touch? No, it isn't. But Dana Sutter, and this is going to be a second touch if Colby Dodo is not on time, and he is not. And that's a second touch for Fantastic War there. Yeah, second touch. But didn't go, got it back. And did uh, TTT has two flag defenders? Did I see that correctly? It looks like. Okay. TTT needs to reorganize at this moment. And, uh,. Uh, they they are they are in the front they they are there but didn't get close to their flag yet but i think there is if they look at the positioning of demon and daniel now they have perfect positioning and now is the time for ttt to push up as soon as they they start killing it's time to push up and i hope they do that and uh fun fact by the way ttt didn't bring back the uh, flag so uh yeah. I, th I think you learned them this, uh, that as well, uh, isn't it? Yeah, that's right. They, they, they know. Um, they learned this from the uh, first team. So Daniel still holding the north end side, but getting killed by Tana. The communication is really, really good between both teams. Basically, they're yeah. look. They're looking exactly where where the people are. And they know exactly now as well Tana in the middle and killing call me Dodo so really good trade-off by Fantastic War again leaving the TTT back at their base trying to get back to the 50 line and Fantastic War is trying to do the same back to the 50 line and uh, I get an uh, not important Flash Ranger god damn it <laughs> <laughs> but uh Fantastic War making presence though in the middle, trying to carefully move up. 
They run through the 50 line and then they start slowing down. Dana and Daniel trying to go. Inukas is there though. Call me Dodo is there though. And they get Tane. Tane is dead. In but in 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 Inukas in 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 didn't hear him, didn't see him. Free kill there. Okay, El Basto, the Chisas and Demon are still at their flag. It's not open. Inari is spotted. He gets El Basto throws a nade. Inari throws a nade. We will die. No. And no. Okay, TRS and L1 are there. Well defended by El Basto. And uh, Demon as well, uh, flanking L1. But El Basto knows there is Inari behind the wall. And Fantastic War probably got the call that Inari is still making chaos at the lines because I see two guys from blue just running up. Now he's dead. And finally the, the well, Inari died by Daniel. Nenward, the guy that was running up, also died. So uh, I uh, I see Tana holding and uh, Tana getting killed by L1. <laughs> oh, L1. That's minus one RPG kills. I, uh, I don't know what happened there. I think it hit the roof and uh, killed yeah, uh, Tana. Like, yeah. So, uh, accidents can happen, but if they uh, get a flag touch now, then uh, it was a uh, bad accident, let me put it that way. Demon uh, killing TRS. So, are the, uh, are the TTT guys mostly losing 556 weapons? Just a question, because I yeah. know... I know that you guys from the tactical training team one likes the five, five the, the fast firing weapons basically. That's right. Yep. So uh, and uh, it's funny to see because yeah you have TTT what is basically trained by TTT you have uh, Fantastic War what is trained by uh, SOF um, and of course it's all player preference if if you don't like the six point five you take something else but these people are like. Uh, taking the advice of the, the higher teams in this case of uh, doing and it's fun to see that both teams have a different look on the, the, the game basically like what is better and how to do it but till now it's going quite well and much more more rockets than in the other yes. game as we expect Nicholas already said it and I'm going to recall it again Rockets is pro sacred. <laughs> yeah. Fantastic war on a nice killing spree now. Maybe yeah. it's a chance to uh upping up the pressure. Inari is still there. Daniel oh. died. That Jesus. Oh look Jesus. at the last last this, defender. This is going to be five guys from uh uh Fantastic War that is trying to hold. The Jesus died as well. And now they going to do the pain it's, train. It's the pain, it's just the pain train, Nick. Is this the is this the pain train that we're going to see in the uh, in the last match? Because it seems like Inari and Aluan trying to get up the spawn positions. Aluan has a nice position, but getting killed by Call Me Dodo, well called. But still, TRS and Inari are at their line. Inari but getting killed, but TRS knows where he is, gets the trade kill. Call Me Dodo is still there. At least it looks like. The uh, stopped. Like, indeed. Well done, but, but uh, they after got three flag touches, first flag score. Indeed. For Fantastic War. Really well played by Fantastic War. Out of fucking nowhere, they had suddenly uh, five guys at the at the at the TTT flag, and uh, I I didn't know where it was coming from. I honestly didn't know. Suddenly there were five guys, and they completely overrun TTT here. So uh, well done, but TTT is not uh, letting it down and trying to uh, instantly come back. El Busto getting a nice kill. Tana trying to get the trade kill, but uh, didn't do it. Call me Dodo on a nice angle, though. L1 uh, getting uh, for Tana killing Call me Dodo, but still one, still more alive. El Busto is there. He hears him. L1, L1 carries his team. On the one side, killing two players, and now they are on the attack again. Daniel's open again. Still, Daniel, on maybe Daniel can go back and support like defending. 
I don't think they, uh, that this, but the spawn is going on at this moment. They're running through, but they should know they're they're spawning at this moment. Uh, Tana already killed by Komi Dodo. Well done. And Eluan holding line. Daniel still though on the left hand side, uh, holding the uh, the north side at the construction part. Demon uh, coming around uh, Eluan, looking the right way, so knowing there was somebody there. And sadly, Daniel died in the uh, construction yard. Mm. Attack repelled, it looks like. Attack repelled. Everything is back to calm. And just now we have a calm moment. And that's after 15 minutes of gameplay. And there goes a rocket again. And it didn't kill anything, sadly enough. But a nice rocket. Nice place to shoot a rocket as well. Yeah. I like the fact that they are using the rockets like... Oh, and the counter rocket. And nothing killing. So, lots of rockets, lots of nades. And uh, like, trade in the middle again uh, between Nanao and Abasto, Demon on the run. Yep, L1 there, I think. Yep, L1 is the left hand side player. Tana getting killed. So TTT doesn't, it's not that they're uh, that they're far behind, it's just Fantastic War had an amazing push. But I think if yeah, TTT was really hard, yeah. TTT, if they can get control of the middle line, they can push back Fantastic War as well because now they're, they're playing too much on their own line. And like I said, um, to be honest, I like the red side more to play. So from red to blue. Uh, but uh, maybe TTT is better on the blue side and maybe Fantastic War likes the blue side and it can ha happen halfway. For now, is Fantastic War on an, uh, on an uh, yeah spree basically? Yeah, that's right. Inuka's almost killing Demon there, uh, but probably shouting that there was 20 fly going on. Now three guys on the right or on the south end side going for L1. L1 hearing one, killing one. L1 hearing two, killing two. Only one left. Is he going to... He knows he's there. And he doesn't get the third kill. He did, he did peek the corner on the wrong way. Demon killing two. This opens the field for Demon though. But there's somebody... In the middle line. And this hey. is this is what I like about storage. You can defend every line on every position. If you know your mate dies on the light, light right or on the left. Uh, you can basically hold and just see running over. And then you just need to shoot right. Right on the left side. In a re and Daniel. Tana and Nanrod moving up together. El Busto though there to intercept at least one of them. But does not get the kill. Call me Dodo instantly looking around. But thinking it was Tanner there only. But still Nanward is only there uh, as well there. Nice nade by Nanward. That is just getting... Flag defender dead. Yep. And he's going to go for the touch. But Danny was there to intercept. Didn't get it. Lots of nades going on. But he gets the touch. But brings them on four touches. Yeah. And already L1 is there to follow up. L1 is already over the 60 line uh, trying to uh, get there. We have Komi Dodo in the middle though. Trying to hold. And again. Oh, sorry. So, did you hear that? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> and again. Uh, the flag is uh, being uh, un untouched because they can easily defend it over there. TRS on the right at hand. Nukas. Yeah. It looks like. Uh, TDT can't hold the pressure against uh, Fantastic War no. in the first half. Everything can happen. That's 100% sure. Um, Inari still being in the back, but uh, a nice line push by TTT again. And hopefully they can uh, bring something out of it. El Busto will it pass Nanrod. Nanrod should see him. Either he did not see him or he did not give a fuck. Nanrod killing Daniel, so uh, they're coming up. L1 uh, holding that, uh, yeah, we call it storage building and office building uh, pretty well. Uh, Nukas, uh, in Nukas, being behind him, just waiting for L1 to pass. Is he El, Basto, El Basto searching for Gator, waiting for the defending. And now, I okay. think he's caught. He's caught out now. Oh, push okay. at the DDT flag. Okay, call me Dodo. Well played. Call me Dodo on a rage. Yep. 
Well played. How did the, how did the attack? And uh, we still have, uh, yeah, there we have it. El Basto on the, at, on the best spawn camp position. Look at that line that he can hold. He can basically shoot everybody that is coming by. But as soon as Fantastic War knows he's there, he should be uh, flushed out. Because now they know and they have nobody to follow up and El Basto dies. Demon uh, coming over the right hand side. T Rocket going in and killing Demon. Well done by uh, L1. Well done. Again, L1 really MVPing these Rockets, mate. Like, it's unbelievable. And Fantastic War is just on point. They're on fire 100%. And uh, they're not giving up. And uh, I'm getting an attack. Uh, I will, uh, I see, I did see your message, Nicholas, only I don't understand. I will speak to you after this round. Is this that? Okay, here we go again. Uh, fantastic war, out of nowhere, three guys. Demon still there, though, to intercept. That Jesus and Call Me Dodo. <laughs> and Tana getting crossfired, but Inari yeah. and Nunrat still being there. Inuka's also on the cross. L1 on the dead. cross. So Ilo one Nana and TRS on the attacking. None word knows he's there. One defender is called out. Nice crossfire again. They but yeah, uh, you see now TTT uh, opted in for two flag defenders. And it's paying off because Fantastic War is just trying to get those flag touches in. Not even trying to get the flag captures because otherwise they would have secured the area like they did the first one. But they are just playing for flag touches at this moment. What is a smart thing to do, to be honest. L1 still alive. The Chisa searching for him. Doesn't see him. Demon going forward. Inukas running past. Il and L1... L1 uh, holding position. Although TTT is now getting a little bit of hold on the 50 line. Although uh, their uh, 10 is uh, to... Uh... Nice, nice grenade from Daniel. Killing in the re. L the, L1 the thinks the flag defender is dead. But they still have Komi Dodo. Komi Dodo is sitting there. And he kills him. L1 thought the only flag defender was the Chisas. And uh, yeah, got killed by Komi Dodo. Now Inuka's also killed uh, Tana, so there's no follow-up. There's still one guy at the other guys, and it's Demon, but he got killed by uh, Gator, I think. Yeah. So, while TTT has been moving flag defenders all around the whole time, Gator is still in the same building. And, uh... Yeah. yeah because he, he isn't tested that hard. And, uh... Yeah, really well done. Really, really well done by them. And um, it's been silent again. Eight minutes left on the clock. Fantastic War is holding the lines. And uh, now TTT needs to break that. Yeah. No flag touches, no flag scores. Inuka's killing L1. Demon getting down though, but nice nade by Damon. Inari again at this garage building, isn't he? Yeah, Inari is being annoying at the garage building. Ton of killing Elvis, to, though. Try to flank the flag, the flag defenders. Yep. And he succeeds. Maybe, maybe he can catch Komidoro off guard. But then there's still the Chisas around. And um, the uh, Fantastic War guy, is he now just trying to bait them out? Yeah, it looks like it. And another counter rocket goes, and that do does mean that the counter rocket from uh, uh, Fantastic War can stay out. So I expect that within two minutes as well. Inari killing first. El Busto knows where Inari is. He can't move anyway. I heard smoke grenades in the middle. Oh yeah. And Inari killing El Busto. Inari is doing. Quite hard. Is this smoke grenades from Fantastic War? Isn't it? It looks it looks like, yeah. Okay, Tana and Nunward and Inari still at the flag. Call me Dodo and the Chisa is defending. They check the corners. Nunward only alone and alive. Inari still on the flank. 
in a retrying to wallbang them. Nenrod's still alive. The Chisas died by Nenrod. Then he will try to refire Inari. Where's that support from TTT? Demon should trade kill with Demon. Demon. Okay, he got him. And Nenrod died as well because Nenrod tried to run for the flag. Like I said, there's there's no flag control at the moment, and they try to get to the touches. So they just, I really, uh, they really want to try to win on touches because if flag, if TTT even gets a score now they are still far behind on touches and that can win you the game they need a second score at least nice the, grenade i just missed it i saw somebody Same. sitting <laughs> sitting pretty nice. i saw a red guy in the corner with the blue guys and i only thought mm -hmm. there was a spawn camp but they flushed him out straight on the forehead the grenade and the counter rocket there counter it is rocket, no kill The smoke, smoke grenade still blooming. Okay, here we go again. Fantastic war over the uh, south side. Demon in the middle though, getting killed by uh, non a ton, eh? That means two guys are left, yeah. and in he knows there's always somebody in this building. First killing the Chisa, shoot, run around, check the corner, doesn't do it. Then run for the follow up. Try, did Volbang did, did Volbang call me Dodo? But Inukas being there on the right time at the right position and uh, yeah, getting it. But Fantastic War now finds out where the spawn or the spawn campers, where the the, the flag campers, Campus. yeah, are sitting and they start pre-firing that corners and that's well done because they of course try to to round it up but there's not a lot of places where you can hide as a flag defender l1 holding right. fire well done by him l1 knows where jesus is i think yeah yeah he saw he saw her uh, going into that uh, corner that's what i mean Quiet. and, and uh, no flag defender left and uh, TRS is there also. He knows he needs That's to run touch. back over the right bad side. TRS is there and to defend him. Although... Ilukas, Ilukas can't intercept. And yeah. That looks like the second flex score for Fantastic War. Did Demon? Yeah, Demon did die. Demon's and dead. Gator did indeed change positions. And look at that position where he's laying on. Like yeah, Pretty far away. But uh, like in a straight line. Exactly on the, the straight line. Flag. And L1 uh, running uh, running back with the flag, the run for victory, it is, what brings them back at uh, two flag scores, and uh, really well done. I we we can't train them anymore because we need to play against them in the pro circuit now. <laughs> okay, can TTT bring it back? Because I have the feeling. TTT can bring it back though. Like, it's. They, Fantastic War is being really offensive, but TTT on, the, on this moment has nothing to lose. And I have the feeling if they, like I said earlier, if they get map control over the middle, they can get there. Uh, the demon just got killed by a stray. stray nice. shot? Nope. Communication looks not that good on the. Attacking uh, from from TDT, Inari miss El Basto. El Basto now lonely at the Fantastic War flag. Doesn't check the building. G tries tries to free fire another corner where he thinks that uh, Gator is, but Gator uh, changed positions. Move. And uh, well done, Gator again uh, defending the flag. And. Uh, Gator is again on a really good uh, kill death ratio. Let's check it out. Where is he? Uh, 4 to 0. So they came uh, to the flex 4 <laughs> to 0. But in the meanwhile, while I'm checking that, Fantastic War is already all over the TTT flag. And, yeah. uh, and they're going hard for it. Inari again on his same position. He really likes that position sitting there. Demon trying to pre him around the corner. And getting it as well. So it's that she's has left against these three guys. And of course they know where she's sitting. Yep. 
Tony get her. Yeah, that's the flag touch and the capture. And there's no TD Tealer to intercept that. And they go back with the uh, the flag. They get the kill now on the last. Like Fantastic War has amazing pushes where they just come up out of nowhere with four or three guys and then they just overrun the uh, uh, the guys. And again, uh, Nenrod uh, with uh, pre-firing all around, just supporting fire. TTT need to repack himself. That's 100% yep. sure. For the second half. One minute left. Three to zero captures and six to zero flag touches. Yep. And I'm really curious if uh, TTT is going to bring this back. Uh, uh, what are they the going? Half, yeah. uh, what are they going to do to stop this fantastic war against uh, for killing so well? Because they didn't have enough, and they're coming already with four guys up to the flag. They know what the flag positions are. Pre-fired one, didn't kill. Rocket goes nowhere, and Tana knows where he is. Pre-fires, comes around the other corner. Jesus killed him. Inari get killed by uh, Daniel. The TRS knows where the other one is, but Daniel having a good line off him. Again, so it was just not. Hold for the last twelve seconds. Don't get. Uh, don't get touches again. Heavens, not another touch. So. Really well played by uh, Fantastic War and the one with the last kill, probably killing Demon, and it is. Yep. GG. GG first house, yeah. Well done, by uh, fantastic boy. for the second half for the TTT. Wave that, wave that TTT flag. Wait a second, that will bring us back to uh, the uh, caster cam soon. For uh, now, uh, the kill that stage, and uh, yeah, it's looking good for fantastic war. They've been there, but again, only twenty kills between them, and that's not a lot. That's still close to each other. Like I said, I still feel that TTT can bring back the. Uh, bring back the game if they get map control and that's the whole thing now and uh yeah you wanted uh, to sh show that support for ttt and uh, if you're in the chat show that support for fantastic war because they've been doing an amazing uh amazing game amazing amazing first half so uh we can uh expect in second half and yeah i need i to... think we i think we're back in three to, three to five minutes I uh, the second half. I think yeah. they need uh, uh, night, like five minutes to reorganize, basically. To reorganize, yeah. And uh, yeah, well, uh, we're going to be a uh, small break for five minutes, and then uh, yeah, we will be back uh, shortly with you with the second round of the grand final. Yes. See you soon. See you soon. Welcome back, Smickler. Schmickler. Schmickler. <laughs> Welcome back, Nick, for the second half of the Grande Finale on this uh, ESM Cup. Yeah, we saw a really strong half uh, from the Fantastic War guys. Um, keeping up the pressure, overwhelm the two, uh, the one or two flag defenders from TTT and getting the flag safe back at home for at least three times. Yep. So um, TTT needs four flags now for um for win um could be hard though i uh i'm still in for for everything is possible comeback is real uh and such but it's it's pretty hard in the on the in on the um on the individual level i think the fantastic war uh shoot better than the uh the tdt Players. But um, yeah, We're, we know what Carbine is going to say. If Fantastic War wins this, he will probably praise the six point five weapons. Um, I don't want that. <laughs> but um, yeah. let's hope for a good, uh, good second half with a little more of TDT pressure, and then Fantastic War is indeed having the overhand at this moment. But I, I, I'm still. I'm still feeling TTT can do more, and I I just hope that they they can do more because it's map control and Fantastic War is being really really good in map control at this moment, and 
uh, TTT couldn't break it. Uh, as soon, uh, I just have the feeling as soon as TTT gets that little bit of map control and the pain train starts a little bit rolling, maybe Fantastic Ball will be thrown off and they will start to panic a little bit because that happens when people get killed. And uh, yeah, hopefully the TTT comes, throw something back at least. Oh, yeah. uh, for now, we don't have uh, the... Uh, um, scores yet uh, it will be shown as soon as we get into the game uh, but for now Fantastic Wars has indeed three flag scores and uh, six flag touches and tactical training team have none of both uh, sadly enough they couldn't That's get right. past the uh, what is it Megano line from uh, Gator <laughs> I've seen uh, Gator is apparently the French Megano line um, normally the Germans did succeed it but uh, this time they didn't <laughs> Not this time, at least. <laughs> but yeah, we will see. Um, Gator with an uh, four, four uh, with an in four zero kill death ratio from uh, from defending. So yeah, it's pretty hard to break the defending. Okay. Uh, oh yeah. Oh, it's start. Oh, a little lag for me. So Ron started. Yeah, yeah, we're going in. So, uh, and here we go. It's the round, round two for tactical training team against who's, Fantastic who's War. Joining? Who's joining there? I don't know. Uh, probably in. Uh, I press F5, I press F1, and I press O, and then I'm telling that TTT is playing on the blue side, and Fantastic War is playing on the red side. And before the match starts, let's take a look if they will grab anything. Uh, to shoot each other with and I'm going to bet on a yes <laughs> I think L1 is gaking the rocket launcher and will he get a kill that's something I don't know but yeah. he will try he will try at least can you check the blue side as well I will I will I will really weird to see one of the cars is already burning I don't know funny oh yeah funny don't die by the burning car that's right and the Commodore to get the rocket launcher. And L1 as well. L1 is the rocket launcher player. Is going into the construction building where he gets a complete sight of the other side. And Komi Dodo gets two kills. The well done. Kill. Well done by Komi Dodo. And L1 responds with a kill. And that's. Retaliation. <laughs> it's fun to see that both teams are getting basically kills on each other with the rocket launcher in the start of the game and Colby yeah, Dodo now fun. having having two kills um, amazing really good well done broke the French wall broke the French wall but will it push TTT to go forward killing two of uh, Fantastic War instantly Nukas is uh, at least trying uh, I think Nukas is spotted by Tane no I don't oh, no. think so TRS is there though and L1 should have heard that. Didn't look around. And Inuka's getting him in the back. And TTT suddenly has the overrent because they're only one on the right or one on the south end side. And one, uh, the Mechano line is still standing though. Now but it's time. TTT, no, go push, push, push. Grenade at Gator. Pre oh, there. Uh, Gator's getting supported by Spawn. It uh, took them uh, quite a long time. The guy on the... Uh, yeah, but it doesn't matter. They're still going. They now know where he is. They had to be wait. Maybe wait next time for... Uh, yep. uh, for them to push. Yeah. For letting the spawn... The spawners come and kill uh, the fresh spawn guys. And then... Yeah, then. they were... They were too far away uh, and too slow. And uh, now the complete push of TTT is halted by uh, Fantastic War. And uh, there goes the line from Fantastic War up to the 50 line. And passing soon the 50 line to the 60 line. And look at that control that they have. They, that line formation that they are holding at this moment is perfect. And they are killing as well. And not losing any guys. Elwando, Elwando. Nope. Tana getting killed by uh, Call Me Dodo, but uh, the the line is pushing up. L1 though, and again L1. Then the complete line is pushed up to towards their flag. 
Inari hurrying a guy there, so and as well now Inari is dead as well. Yep. And Nenward is going for that flag touch. Trying to pre-fire that corner. But that Jesus is there in a sneaky position. Shooting single shot. Nenward to death. Ah. That looks like that the TDT can break the, uh, the power play from Fantastic War. But we will see. There's still one from Fantastic War alive. It's TRS sitting in the bushes. Nah, yeah, not in the, more in the shadow. And Demon see that see him. El Bosto killing Tane. And this is the time. Even if uh, TRS is uh, still alive, you should push up. Inuka's killed. Uh, and TRS going for the flag touch, but the Jesus got him. It is a flag touch for uh, the uh, Fantastic War, though. And uh, Ilawan is there to follow up on the other side. El Bosto got killed by Fantastic War and Nenrod. And Daniel still holding at the uh, yellow containers. Having two guys coming to him. Didn't kill Inari. And Nenrod is there to try to shoot him. Didn't succeed as well. Well defended by Daniel. Really well. Is L1 still alive? No. Nope. Returned. Nope, he didn't. <laughs> he did. He died. So to be honest, even if Fantastic War had a great push and a flag touch again, TTT is doing a little bit better in map control. A bit again, move that line up to the 50 line, hold that line, and uh, trying to uh, get there. And here we go. That's one kill in the middle. Yeah, Donna. but but what we see, uh, being uh, bringing a single guy through the lines near the flag. In uh, Nukas, near the flag, doesn't T work. We need and more. And T TRS killing Demon and in Nukas, Dodo tries to follow up though and gets the kill on TRS. And that means that there's Daniel's, two. Daniel is spotted from Inari, I think. Oh, Daniel is already there. I thought there was only two. Yeah, but Gator, Gator, the French wall. Yep, the French war. Yeah, Hold it off. Look, look, look. That's what I said. You, you can't push oh. one guy to the enemy flag and uh, running against the flag and n not getting killed and such thing. You have to bring more. At yep. least two. Two or three guys uh, the... or girls or girls near, <laughs> the, near the enemy flag. So the, then you can overwhelm the flag defender. <laughs> Doing, doing the superhero thing and running, running alone doesn't work. It that's uh, especially what, what we will learn here. Just as just we're and now not we're, winning the TTT, the TTT is not in the position to go for flag touches. Basically, they need to have that flag control. They're uh, two flag scores behind or three. Three flag scores behind. And they need to get that flag control instead of that flag touch. Uh, as long as you don't get that flag control, there's nothing to do. L1 checking corners though. Doesn't see anybody and the Jesus in the same spot that Gator was earlier. Only standing up. I think he reported that to Tana though. Tana carefully. El Busto searching for somebody as well. They know there's more here. And look at Fantastic War. Tana and TRS are just holding the line. They are just waiting for friendlies to come up because they're alone. Yeah. And TDT failed with cleaning up the deck space. And there goes there comes Tana. Tana knows that he's getting shot from that position. Almost kills the Chisas, but Akomi Dodo is there to intercept. TRS as well died because he moved up. Don't move up. That's the key. That's the key. Don't move up. He just killed from the from Inari, supporting the attack. Yeah. And look, and, and look, Inari is waiting. I mean, he's dead now, but <laughs> uh, uh, he he waits for support. And there's there's support. Nana is coming. Iluan is coming. Call me Dodo. Yeah. A little bit trigger happy, but he gets and, the kill. And, oh, no, and, 
and TTT uh, lose so much player power to cleaning up, to finding the ones that are near their own flag. So yep. there's nobody to push. No. Nope. There are only so many people uh, are on the on the way uh, to to clean up um, the fantastic war player, and then yeah. Nobody to push. It's the same here with L1. L1 was holding Call Me Dodo, El Busto, and I think it was. Uh, I don't know exactly who it was though, but any another player of TTT busy at the storage department, uh, but gave him the opportunity to push elsewhere basically. And um, again, TRS holding at the building. Inuka's trying to find because he died by him. TRS. Didn't oh did kill him and he flies away. <laughs> <laughs> My people need me. <laughs> yeah, but uh, uh, one uh, another interesting thing, what we see uh, in the past from the TTT um, Bond team is uh, that there are so some players like Pio or Baker that can easily win a one one on three at the enemy flag. So yep. the 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 strategy to push one guy through the the enemy lines and then going ham on the flag defenders that works that works from the uh, for the tactical we tactical team one it works of but course it looks like uh, for the tactical team two of course more personal on enemy flags needed okay fantastic wars all over the flag now four guys yeah. four guys l1 not getting a kill. She's still alive though. Tana knows exactly where she is. And getting the kill. But there's a nade there. There's a nade there, Tana. If I'm correct. And it... Can he capture the flag? He can. Tana's still alive. El Buster trying. TRS there to support. And uh, he got enough attention from uh, both Danny and El Busto to run away with the flag. Yeah. And now is the question. Where are you going to run to? Which side is open? Yeah, all sides are open, but there's no support. Nice rocket, though. Uh, sadly, no kill. Tana getting searched by Daniel. Daniel knows exactly where he's running to, but it seems like Tana will bring the flag back home. Yeah, Daniel choose the, the wrong way, the longer way. And yeah, that's the fourth. But um, going back, uh, oh, because... Uh, so Suddenly, out of nowhere, we had this uh, massive uh, thing. And TTT is doing quite well now because they know we should push up. But L1 and TRS are there. Danny was still alive. In the middle, Luke Inakas and Cole Madodo still alive. It is still a possibility. Danny was still alive. L1 searching for Danny, though. Well done by N1. So going back to... Uh, 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 the fact that you said, like, yes, of course, an, a, a single player that can take uh, three players, uh, for example, indeed, Pio, uh, can help a lot. But at the at the end, it's all a team game. If you you need yeah, to be right, yeah. you need to be worked into each other, and I see that in uh, SOF as well. Um, we we have some decent players all along us, but um, still we we can win against ttt and we did also lose against ttt it's not only winning ttt on a nice push though although l1 died um there's still it's a team game it's communicating and trying to keep your calm and that's the most important thing in this game mode and yes of course if you have a team of six po's you're going to have a hard time but <laughs> that's right yeah but we don't have a team of six po's and uh Fantastic War doesn't have a team of six POs, and if, uh, El Boss or TTT doesn't have a uh, team of six POs. And again, TTT has tried to do a spawn trap though, and uh, they're playing way more on uh, Fantastic War's flag at this moment. I have the feeling. <laughs> yeah, nothing more to say. Don't really see uh, TTT coming back. Uh, in this environment, to be honest, there's a possibility. Seven minutes left. Everything. Seven. Uh, Seventeen. Seventeen. Yeah. But uh, yeah, as I said, bringing one guy or girl through the enemy lines. Yeah, Daniel is doing doing great job. He's uh, holding off Denver. Uh, 
And uh, look at this. Daniel is like holding off one guy. And the rest of the Fantastic War is pushing. So they don't give a fuck about Dan of Daniel sitting there. They have Gator. They have Gator, the French wall. The French wall is there. I need. And I Inari, Inari on his way to flanking Daniel. And Daniel can't do nothing about it. Yep. Did he die? El and, and here again, here we go. We have three guys from Fantastic War all over the flag. Killing the Chisas, I think. Yep, and TRS is taking the flag back home. And L1 and Tana are holding the flag line. This this really looks like pro sacred play. I need to tell you that from Fantastic War. Yeah, the only guy who can ex uh, who can um, intercept was Elbasto, but he revealed himself by running around and getting killed. Can I just? Uh... Tell you like how uh, Tane is lagging. Uh, do you think he's going instantly for the capture if he's uh, if he's uh, if he's yeah. brought back, or do and you she think just, he's... she just didn't check? Okay, I think he's doing it. He's doing it. Yep, he's doing it, and he has a free run as well, doesn't he? That Jesus did it. Well done, well peaked, Tane. No. He peaked the Chisas, but not El Busto. And if he killed the Chisas and run away, then uh, you had another flex scar. Scar. So well done by Fantastic War. Like I said, out of nowhere, you see, you you're watching the battle yourself, and out of nowhere, there's suddenly a shit ton of Fantastic War players at the at the flag, and yeah, and it's just well played by them. They're what. With better individual skills, they're tanking through the middle, and they but just not, not all alone. Uh, so mm. it's uh, they are only uh, uh, every time two or three guys in the push, and yeah, yeah. And the, the rest of the guys, one is running back, and the rest of the guys just tries to hold off TTT, and uh, it's working out for them. It's looking really, uh, really good for them at the moment. Uh, being on five flag scores, just wrecking, yeah, TTT. I don't like to say it, but they they are doing it's it. A pretty clear win, yeah. At, at least it, it it looks like for now. TTT needs now four flag scores and if five 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 flag scores and uh, yeah, I think four touches or five touches. Uh, or six, uh, six touches for. For the win, then a shit ton of touches and uh, to basically better uh, have. Uh, they need five flex scores to win. Five. At least five or six, uh, six even because the first all of us uh, three flex scores. They can't. They can't. Five they can't. The game. They can't. Uh, no, no so, they can't. You're completely right. So they 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 need four uh, five. They flex scores now and one thousand flex touches. So. Um, yeah, uh, TTT didn't get anything uh, yet. Uh, with one more flex score, uh, Fantastic War will uh, seal the deal, basically. And uh, yeah. L1 uh, feels the uh, feels everything, but gets killed by Demon. Um, but yeah, look at the map. Look at the map. I'm no looking. TTT la, no, no one from TTT on the uh, 50 line. So. It looks like they can't stand the pressure from the Fantastic War guys. It's... Look, look th three. Three red players near the flag now. Three. Yep. And uh, here we go again. Call me Dodo shot though. Inari knows exactly where he is, but gets killed. Nonwatch should follow up. Nope, it is Tanne. Okay, here we go again. Fantastic War pushing, but uh, TTT seems to have everything on full defense at the moment. Do you think they know that if they get another flex score, it's over? That they are yeah, but uh, waiting for the last twelve minutes uh, with the it's only the of your players it won't make you any flex. So. It's 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 delaying your own loss basically. Uh, pushing up with all of you just seems like the most logical thing to do at this moment. Yeah. When these fire accidents now happen, I think they are in a little tilt mode now. They need to 
Yeah, yep. concentrate more. El Wondo uh, also uh, saw Nonward uh, as an enemy and died there. And we have three defenders, like Libero here, uh, what is uh, Call Me Dodo, Demon, and uh, Chases. And everybody's playing really carefully. Fantastic War as well, trying to get mid control. Call Me Dodo and El Basto are there, but this is going to be a crossfire. Tana knows where he's going, so go around that corner. Doesn't see him. Call Me Dodo comes around the corner, should see Tana. And they trade. 6.5, Carbine would say. Yeah. That's not uh, good for the de defending is, TPP. Is, is L1 still alive? Yep. And the yeah, Jesus yeah. is uh, below him. And uh, L1 is sitting uh, stiffly. There's the rest to, uh, to help him out. L1... Uh, L1 with the MX. With the machine gun, it seems. Yeah, I heard the yeah. machine gun, yeah. Yeah, that's the machine gun. Did he? But uh, the Jesus is also still in here. And I don't think he knows that he's in here. He changed positions. He was compromised. And... Uh, Let's have a look if if she can... Hold him up. Hold okay, the uh, yeah. other oh. one uh, getting killed by uh, El Basto. And... Uh, yeah, t there, there it comes again. Fantastic War trying to go out to the middle and it seems like fantastic war is just trying to do the suppressing fire just shooting in the direction where the enemy should be uh mm. more often because i see tana as well he has no line of sight of any of these guys and he's just firing because there's there's somebody Rock it's... launcher attack no kills but yeah look look again to Fantastic War with the support of TRS in oh, the back. I'm really curious if they're going to wallbang the. Uh... Okay, and Demon and uh, Albasto cleared it up really nice there. I uh, hope to see that they wallbang the uh, container if that's uh, possible. Uh, is TRS still alive? No, he died. Okay. No, he... So Fantastic War is uh, all but on for now. And uh... and you see Lonely. Lonely Daniel at the front again. No support is seen. Yeah, yeah. if if he gets compromised now, it doesn't have any I use, think, and he is already compromised I think, because I, it. I think he is. He is compromised. In a relook at the right. And look, look at that fire through the wall. They're just thinking like, "Fuck this shit." We're shooting through the wall. And again, like, they they are running away for him they don't they don't give a shit about him that he's there inari is walking around and will get him he did get three kills though but it's really good but there's yep. can't uh, use it can't use it they they they, they can't use it indeed they, they there's nobody to follow up and uh l1 uh, going madhouse here again uh the cheese are still alive though l1 uh what are you doing? You're going around. Don't pass the yellow flags. Okay, look at this. Look at this position. Yeah, I see it. The Chisas not moving out. Demon still there. Okay, they should be called out both now. Inari on the flanking position. And Fantastic War just hauling ass into the... Uh, into the... Uh, into the middle. In a re-killing yep. Daniel. Getting to the, the 50 line, holding up the pressure. Yeah, there's nothing you can do. Eight minutes. And eight minutes left. Are they going to do a flex score before the end of the match and claim themselves champions of this uh of this tournament? Yeah, it looks like. Looks like it. And a trade. So Fantastic War a little bit back and I I feel when like it's for both teams eh? I feel when you see Fantastic War has one or two guys in the front it's like it's not enough to roll them over TRS dying die by Call Me Dodo but um, as soon as they, they get like a roll as soon as it starts rolling and they get like multiple guys moving at the same time they will just overrun them uh, when there's one or two guys at their line, yes, there is a little bit of chaos, but mostly TTT can come back from that. Now again, T TTT Daniel and uh, Inukas uh, 
trying to move forward in a re knowing that Danny was there kills him and as well in a re really far behind player I I'm used to him being far in front but he's more defensive yeah. now I mean he looked at the scores uh, he know that they're basically one uh, with five flex scores in front then yeah maybe he switched priorities and a little it can be happening in a re in the middle now trying to shoot El Busto getting it and that means that the bridge is open in a re TRS and Tain Tane all in the uh, way up to their flag um, I was looking at the scores for the guys that were there and um, here we go Kijk, look at him. He's trying to wallbang him. Inari. Well done by Inari. Nice. Nice rocket though. Yep. There's none rocks. Right. Look, look again. Three fantastic war. Near the spawn and uh, near the flag. Waiting, talking, getting the angles. Tana dying by a good nade though. Demon dying. Albusto still alive. Peaks at the right moment, Inari still alive. And El Bustle well defended, but is it enough? Fantastic War needs to reorganize, TTT needs to reorganize. And uh, we're going to see what uh, brings out. Five minutes left. And uh, I can check the scores in the meanwhile, because Fantastic War is being way up and Inukas I missed him but he's like doing Inukas things and Daniel on the other side yeah there we go again so TTT's side players are getting to the flag of Fantastic War but the rest of the players is not following up and I don't know if that's because TTT doesn't have the skill to move up or that Fantastic War is just really good in middle play basically because they've got it to set up yeah. TRS knows where he is or where she is. Just holding the line. Gobi Dodo hears him. Nope. Just waiting. Don't shoot him. That was one. Ooh. He should have called that, that he was going your way there. Nunward was completely surprised. And again, uh, besides uh, TRS Maybe. being... There's a uh, current lockdown on the uh, Fantastic War flag. But there's still Gator. Gator is still alive and Gator is holding his pride. Uh, French Wall. Comidodo supporting De Daniel's dead. Okay, yeah. So that and push is basically dead. Yep. That run is dead. Call me Dodo a little bit too late. And like I said, the, the, the two side players are getting there, but they get cleaned up so quickly before even Fantastic War uh, gets in the position, basically. Really sad. And it doesn't matter. Yep. And, and here we go. And here we ones. go. Uh, kill two guys in the middle. They see that they kill two guys in the middle. And look at that complete push of five guys just walking in yep. a line almost. And they can't even see each other. But they're walking, walking in a perfect line basically. Okay, they know. Daniel not dying. L1 died though by uh, Inukas. But uh, Tana and TRS should be there uh, to uh, follow up. TRS knows where he is. Comes around the corner, and he gets the kill. And look at that perfect... And there we go again. The perfect line decided to move up. Throw some nades in. Well done by Demon. Nice nade. Inari still alive. TR is still alive against two flag defenders. And the game of silent. And here we go again. Fantastic War just... Holding, holding angles. They, they, I. Let's, let's just wait. You know, like we're not, we're not yeah. going to show ourselves completely the whole time. Although Inari uh, died by El Busto. Oh no, wait, not. Now he died by Daniel.
Energy dead. Now L1 and TRS are up to the flank. TRS killing or getting killed by Colby Dodo. L1 there though to follow up. He gets the kill. They know now where he is. Inukas got him. Yep. And here we but go. Yeah, if you need two players or three players to save your flag, you can push that hard. That's and a fantastic that war has, has so many good trade-offs. They get killed by one, there is another from Fantastic War to trade it off. It's just really well done. And uh yeah, I think it's safe to say that uh because you can't run back, less rocket going in, not killing anything. But uh I think we should have uh, asked the chat to uh, let's hear it for a fantastic war. The new reigning champions of uh, the Master Cup after defeating TTT. Till, uh, yeah, TTT2 basically. And uh, welcoming them in the uh, pro circuit at least. One minute left. Yeah, one minute left. Let's look. Let's look like the final uh, final score now. Nothing happens, but uh, yeah. Soon enough, TTT. people will uh, uh, get in the uh, shooting into the air. Shout out to uh, our French wall. Yeah, really shout well out played. To French. Shout out to 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 both teams for bringing up the entertainment uh, in the grand final. A little one-sided, uh, I would say. Really sad, but um, yeah, we saw we saw nice rocket launcher uh, attacks in the second round, and yeah, I I think TTT can bring up more fight than this. I think they were not on their best, though. I uh, I have the feeling that uh, they could have done more, and maybe they don't have their day. That can, but yeah, if you don't have your day. At the grand finals, uh, it will lose you the game, and Did that's you? game over. And um, that is uh, fantastic war, winning the Masters Cup grand, grand finale. Well done! And uh, whoever is that with the sniper, Tanne. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, the last scores again, not far behind, and not far like. Uh, between them, not not a lot. Blue for 101 and uh, up for 107. So, uh, yeah, they died only a little bit more because as well right. friendly fire. But uh, should we uh, should we invite in the meanwhile uh, one of the uh, reigning champions now, uh, the new champions uh, thing? We can ask Il Il one for for in winners interview uh, if you like. I would like him uh, to have him because I think he's uh, really happy. I think there's a lot of shouting in the uh, in the uh, in the thing. I can I can go there and see if they uh, if they uh, have anything. Uh... Okay, let me check. Channel switched. How happy are you? Hello. How are you? What? <laughs> <laughs> well played guys really well played anything to say to uh all the uh all the the viewers that uh watched you win the uh new Hello. master cup okay so Hello. yeah first of all <laughs> okay guys, guys. First, first of all thank you everyone who organized this tournament we're real proud of winning this and we hope that we pleased our team that they're going to, to love us even more and that we, we had fun. Uh, thank you to you, Nick and Sof, to train us. Thank you to TTT for playing and trying to beat us, but they don't manage to do it. It, it happens. We know this. <laughs> We're playing with Sof. Uh, thank you to the castles uh, from everywhere around the world, uh, everywhere in the world, sorry. Uh, Did you expect to win the... Uh... Tournament. We didn't expect because you you placed us in the in the mind that TTT was unbeatable. You know? <laughs> <laughs> uh, sorry, Schmidler, but uh, we won. <laughs> hey, no problem for me. 
Only one thing to say. <laughs> That's a private joke, sorry. <laughs> uh, Gator, we need to say that uh, everybody loves you uh, with your French wall. You're the new Meccano line. So, uh, and you hold it off the Germans this time. So, well done. And uh, We did it for 1940 friends. <laughs> new Magino line. I want to congratulate you on the win. And uh, I hope to see you in the pro circuit. And um, yeah, hopefully, uh, yeah, we'll see you please, there. Please kill SOF then. That's uh, what the... Uh... Dude, the tactical training team won. You can beat them. <laughs> oh no, we, wait, that doesn't work. You can't beat them. But uh, yeah, it's you will have a five minute delay, but uh, I will grab one of the beers that I got for free because you won the first round and you won the grand final. So uh, cheers to you and cheers to Carbiner please. losing his bet. Please. Thank you, Nick, and cheers to you too. I'm we... taking a uh, heavy alcoholic uh, drink to celebrate this. Yeah, we, we have all opened our beer right now. Uh, uh, it was, it's 40 minutes, I'm holding it like no, no. Not now, not now. Now is the time to drink and to celebrate. Really well done, Dace, and uh, yeah, con gonna... congratulations. Hey, Nick, Nick. But yes. Is, is Who's the fucking MVP? <laughs> we don't know yet, that's what you're going to be. Hello. Hello, Flash. Hello. Smith, let's go back. <laughs> and Flash is not coming back. Or, uh, uh, Smith. I'm right? back, I'm back, I'm back here. Yeah. Next time, tell me. We switch the channel, Nick, please. I said. No. Wait a second. <clears throat> that's okay. I'm here now. Nick, what? My neighbor decided to... Uh, uh, to nuke up the no. neighborhood? Or, uh... Yeah, he's timmering or something. I don't know. I, I just entertain <laughs> the viewers because I need to check this out for a second. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah what we see, uh, I tried to say it, it was in the wrong, wrong, wrong channel. Yeah, what we see is f from my side was a really... Um, Nick rambling in the background, a really strong pressure game uh, and and power play in the second half from the fantastic war guys. You see, as I, as I said in the game earlier, um, bringing bringing one guy through the enemy lines doesn't work well. You need uh, uh, you, you need a, a support line with at least two or three guys to support your lonely main fragger. Um, TDT doesn't have that, and uh, they lost too many of the one on ones. Uh, they have to win on the way to the flag point, and yeah, that's basically uh, at the it, attacking moments for the uh, Fantastic War. They have at least two or three players near the flag, they can overwhelm the single or two uh, flag defenders from TDT, and yeah, scoring the, the points. That's basically summing it up for me, I think. I heard the half of it. My, uh, for everybody, if you hear something in the background, my neighbor decided to, a good idea to fucking construct something at 23.30. So uh, I will go outside soon. Um, I think you just recap the match, Smitler. Yeah, I and... basically told what, what happened from my side of view to uh, why the TTT 2 team uh, seen no um, no light against the Fantastic War power play. Yeah. And uh, yeah, well deserved by uh, Fantastic War though. Really well deserved. They didn't expect it, but uh, really well deserved. Um, do we know who won the fir BR versus A and B round? Can I... Know that. Nicholas, Nicholas Spo you're here. Spoilers you're ahead if you want to. Uh, spoiler alert Nicholas? if you want to. Uh... Yeah, yeah, I'm here. I'm here. Yeah, yeah. Um, so uh, just uh, tell us. Let me check again. So, Brothers in Arms. Yeah. The third place. Okay. So they won against A and B. Yeah. Yes. So, so uh, both German, German teams lost in the final games. It looks Let like. Let me see. Dave won 8 to 1. Holy shit. Oh. 
against A and B. Holy against shit! Against A and B. Against yeah, B yeah, is not that bad as well. I think uh, really unlucky with the placements as well. And uh, yeah, well, go watch it out. I think you can uh, watch the replay out at the uh, uh, Neil Garfield. I think it is. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And for the guys, uh, this is our technical guy, Nicholas, the guy that fucked up the lower bracket uh, thing. So, uh, <laughs> and the upper bracket. <laughs> and the upper bracket. But it doesn't matter. Um, that rest is only one thing we've uh, heard everybody. I think uh, we've seen it all. We can congratulate Fantastic War, and I think we need to leave it with that. There will be an, uh, an after, re uh, yeah, after action report stream. Uh, we don't know when we're going to get some of the clips uh, of the moments that we've seen and we're going to discuss like what happened um, I hope to see F Fantastic War into the pro circuit then we can kill them legally and tactical training team one can till kill them legally as well um, to get That's a little bit so that they, so that they can get the uh, foods back on the ground basically and uh, yeah, I uh, I hope to see you both all or all at the After Action uh, podcast. Let's call it that way. And uh, then it leaves uh, me to say only goodbye. I think Smitleg. Yep. Goodbye to you, Nick. Goodbye to all of you, uh, to all of our viewers. I think it looked like we peaked at like sixty viewers. Really nice. Um, yeah, I would say thank you for all the teams that. Uh, participate in this tournament and give us this great opportunity to cast and uh, have a lot of fun and yeah thanks to the back office uh, lord flash ranger nicholas and everyone who's doing the work quite in the back and uh, shout out at at armor hosts and yeah that concludes this for me i'm um, uh, racing my we, uh, free bottle <laughs> <laughs> i think we so uh, we see us back then in the uh, next up we see uh, for for any information for of the next cup watch the social media channels uh, of uh, of ESM and um, yeah follow us on Twitter and yeah shout Just out at everyone Stay tuned. There will be a new Masters Cup where you can in, and the new, the latest or the the earliest new cup will be the uh, Pro Circuit Cup, where uh, the pro teams basically will be fighting, and we will probably see Fantastic War as well there. So um, let's end it with that. I yes. don't know. I'm I'm raising my glass, and I'm then I'm stopping by street basically. <laughs> Good luck. Good luck, everyone.